Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dat Deck, and today we're playing some more Mind Histories. I'm not actually meant to be recording now. I've done my recording for today, but you know what? I wanted to play Mind Histories. Because we're going back to the nuclear production complex. I've fixed my loadout already. We're taking 5,000 copper, lead, metaglass, graphite, 10,000 titanium, and then just 400 silicon. So I always struggle for silicon. Let's go. And straight away... We want to use these to up things like that. And we're going to get our copper coming in like that. We're going to get the lead from over here. You can just go up like that. I could actually get another one in there, but it's not really going to grab much more. But anyway, we'll do it. Um, you can come up this way. We are going to do the pause building quite a bit because it is more efficient this way. You can come this way, you can come up and round, because then I don't block my uh, core in as much. Titanium, I want to get titanium going straight away. There, there. Let's go there, there, there. There. Honestly, I think there. It's all going to be coming in on titanium belts as well. Right, where do we want to go down? I'm actually going to bring it down this way and in like that. So we're going to need a junction right there. I wish we could get quicker junctions, honestly. That can all come down this way. Pause from them two and in you go. You go there. That can come down and that can go across. So that's titanium going to be coming in as well. Excuse me. I think I want to get even more copper, actually. Whoops, meant to go like that, and can you just come straight down? Near as damn it. You can come straight down this way, go in there. We might as well get, whoops, not that, or that, or that, actually. You know what? This can come in this way, and I can get rid of that. I can get rid of that. You can come down one and across, get rid of that. You can keep going down, down, across. Let's go like that. Want to keep our channels open. Junction right there. Um, you are going to come across and up. Don't need that one, don't need that one. Yeah, we do need these ones. It's a little bit over the top. Go like that. So there's more copper coming in. I think I want to turn this into graphite straight away. Uh, that's probably not going to grab as much as we could get. Let's go more like that. Yeah, this is all going to be graphite. I think I'm actually going to come across this way and we're going to start it right there. Just two multipressors, do we think? Let's see how well two multipressors work. <clears throat> So then you can come there, go there, go there. We want to get a router in right there. I might as well grab this copper as well. Because why not? Is there any way I can... No, I'm going to have to go up and round the top. And you can come in like that. Right, the entire target this time is to try and not blow the reactor up. Just go that way. It'll be fine. I can grab this titanium as well. I want to basically get going straight on the defences. That's the plan at least. That can go there. And you can come across, go up and across. Just need to hook you up. And go like that. Now if I can bring more things through this way, we're going to have less problems, I think. Right there. Don't go right next to that. You can come up there. Oh, this is actually going up that way. We changed it slightly. You're going to come down here and you can actually go straight into that. I need you guys coming straight down here and you can go straight in there. So that's graphite hooked up as well. All right, I think we're good to run pause for now and then we can start working on the defense. Hopefully I've got enough of everything coming in straight away to make all this work. 
I should have. Uh, we're going to need a junction right there. That's it. Get building everything. These are going to need power. I could just throw a little combustion thing down. We only need a small one. For now, until we get proper power going. Like I say, I need to get the coolant going for the thorium reactors first this time. Uh, you need junction and junction. Good. Get this hooked up. That's more titanium coming in. Um... Yeah, this needs power. Duh. Uh, let me get just a little combustion generator. It can go right there. Get a router right there. One of them right there. Give me one of these right there. And then a few batteries just so it's got something to store up. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, these need water. <clears throat> Slight oversight on my part. That can go there then. I don't think we're going to have enough power to get a water extractor going as well. And not just that, I lay this out in kind of a stupid way, honestly. You know what? No, I've not. Well, I have. Yeah, yeah, I have. Nope, don't destroy that. This is getting spaghetti, but it'll be fine. No, you need to come out that way. You need to go there. You need to come down this way, and then you need to go in there. Then I can get water extractor, well, a water extractor on this side. And all we're going to need here is a liquid router and pipe right there. Yeah, we've definitely not got enough power to make this work. <clears throat> I've not screwed that up, have I? No. You're not getting the power or the water you need. Yeah, I'm a little bit ambitious with that, aren't I? Well, that's the only thing using the power, so... So long as it's making some graphite, it'll be fine. Let's get the defences in. I like what we had going last time. So we're going to go for the same thing. <clears throat> uh, can't remember exactly where I started with it, but it seems like about there. And I want to give them as little room as possible to get through here. Now, do I want to do it exactly the same as last time? Because <clears throat> so what I could actually do is zag it back this way. The large menders would reach that. In fact, they would reach a wall up there as well. And just to double check. Yeah, that would reach all of them. What do these take? Silicon. We'd run out of silicon building all this up. But that's the plan, although we are getting the energy in straight away, so we'll see in a second. I think that's what we want to get built up for now. We do want to get some turrets in. Should just get duos for right now. In fact, no, we're going to get these straight away. That's the problem I had last time, isn't it? <clears throat> Although, it doesn't really matter. Because what I can do is wall this last section in. And if I actually block this off and make them loop back around this way. Ooh. I'm going to need to get some miners going as well. For now, they can just have copper. Just throw that down there and that there and uh, that there and there. We'll come and grab all this in one moment. Mm, don't really want to do it like that. Let's go like that instead. Because then you can come down this way and across. You can come down this way. Uh, 
it probably makes more sense to just go like that. And you can actually snake your way up this side. Right there. I'm zoomed out too far. It's dead difficult to do this. There we go. Get the routers in along the back there. <clears throat> We've got 10 seconds until the first wave. You know what? Let's at least try and get this copper coming in. The first wave is just one enemy, right? One enemy, yeah. Well, copper's coming into the first dudes now, at least. Yeah, we've got this. They're going to be fine. Oh no, what are you doing to my walls? I'd prefer it if some of the end units got it, but... Uh, you're going to go across straight to that way. Slight problem. Only a slight problem. I can pad this corner out more. Get lost. If I was to build one of these, it would heal all the way to about like there. So let's pad that in right there. Titanium walls, titanium walls. You know what? I am just going to get these here for the sake of it. They may keep destroying these. If they do, I may not repair them, but... Yeah, them top two should get healed. It's just that one that's not going to get healed. <clears throat> right, we're working on the thorium reactor in a second. So I know we're going to need the titanium down there. I liked what I was doing last time. It's just I didn't have the cooling to go with it. I needed the cooling. Oh, I can't believe that. And I know, it was dead dodgy, me uh, trying to cheese the system and uh, tab back, uh, alt F4. But these are never full already. Yeah, they're full already. We could even build another line of these across the back. And then I'm not desperate for flying units by having salvos up here. Admittedly, I am desperate for getting them up this side. We can see how the defense actually works out now. Oh, I've not built any of this bit across here, so they're probably going to just tuck themselves into the corner. Although they can reach. They can reach. I probably want to get a corner piece in there as well. Got you. Alright, let's get this built up and then we'll go look at that thorium reactor. How am I doing for titanium, by the way? We've used like 3k, that's it. 10,000 might be a bit of an excessive amount to bring in, but screw it. I wanted to be sure. So. So, so, so. You need titanium coming in. I assume that's what this titanium over here is for. I want absolutely all of it. Just come across this way. Go up, across... Up there, you can come down there. And you're going to come across... Now, will you even be able to jump this? Is the question. Or am I going to have to take that out? I'm going to have to take that out, aren't I? Fine. So you've now got titanium coming in. You just need water coming in, which is easy enough. Because we can just get... This coming in like so. That would be water coming in. I just need power going to them. You know what? I can actually hook all of this up for now. Oh yeah, I'm going to need power down here as well. Or up here. To get the thorium going. My defences are solid for now. If I was doing it before with duos, this is going to be no problem at all. And keep coming down. We've got the lines joined all the way up. I just need to get a little bit more power from elsewhere. We can do the water thing again. <clears throat> In fact, I used bridges here, didn't I, last time? Just cut that back. Just cut that back. Yeah, you need cryofluid. Ooh. 
I don't need both thorium reactors going straight away, so I'm not going to try and get both reactors going straight away. You bridge across to there. That wasn't there. Oh no, actually, that was right. You went like that, didn't you? And then that goes there. That goes there, and then my offloader thing goes there. Right, let's get some power going then. Steam generator. Just going to throw one uh, right there for now. Let me get my tiny water collector things. Does that pump straight in? Yeah, it does. I love it. So you just need coal. Easy enough. I'm actually just going to pull from this right here. And then I don't actually need that right there. So you're now producing power. Let's give you just one huge battery for now. Just one. And let's get this all hooked up. Does that reach all of them? No, it doesn't. Leave it. We're good. Yeah, that's good for power for now. Alright, I need to get my water all the way down. Uh, water? Not water. You know what I mean. Are they still going for that corner? I think they're still going for that corner. Might be a slight problem, that. Let's pad this out even more. I thought with titanium walls over this side, they'd try and go the proper way through. How about if I take just one off that end? Make it a little bit easier to get through. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, power. Where were we? Need to come all the way down here. Oops, no. Go from that point, and you can go there. There, you can actually jump over. Yeah, it reaches. I'm trying to keep it as much out of the way as possible, in case I need lines coming down this way. I don't want to step on the scraps either. Can you line up, please? That, we've got these large solar panels here as well. So that hooks that up. That hooks the water up. This has now got cryo fluid going in. Have you got enough water coming in, though, is the thing. Not really. <clears throat> Although, now you're filling up. That still scares me. Let's just get another water pump right there. So all this now requires is thorium. Unloader would go right there. Line would go right there. Don't need that one, apparently. That is all connected up, right? Yeah, it's all connected up. I need to watch the next wave coming in to see what they do. It looks like they're still going for this corner. How about if I pin them in already? Go like that. And go like that. Otherwise, I'm going to have to come up with something else for this side. I need to build them walls there as well because I don't want them shooting around the back. Which they're actually going to be able to do no matter what. <clears throat> now, we want thorium going now. Um, can I just... Bring you off up into this direction. Obviously that doesn't quite reach. Although that one gets power so I can go right in the middle there. Oh no, what have I run out of? I bet it's silicon. I absolutely think it'll be silicon. So 
It's all right. We've got thorium coming in. I need to go and make sure this is working. Oh, I'm nervous. <clears throat> it's got the cryo fluid. This is always going to have enough water and power. I say it's always going to have enough water and power. Oh, let's get up here. I was too slow. Where is that enemy? Right, air defense needs to come up this side next. Get lost. Is that going to be our first bit of thorium? Power output 28. It just needs a lot more thorium, doesn't it? Admittedly, there is only one miner on this side. Silicon. We're short on silicon. Right, I need to get grabbing silicon. I know there's that tiny bit of coal there. There is something down this way. Yeah, let's grab it from down here. You can just go across like that and across like that. Please don't grab scrap. Damn it. It's fine. It's fine. And what did we need for silicon again? I always forget. We'll be able to get more sooner or later. Uh, silicon smelter. It's going to need lead, isn't it? Coal and sand. Okay. There's no sand down here. Now I've got to get the scrap thing going, haven't I? I can take one of these. Just go like that. And that. We need to turn this into sand. I like it how they force you to use some of the other factories that we've not really been using. That goes there. You can go up and across there. And then you can come down this way. Well, that works beautifully. Okay. Okay. Silicon smelter can go right there. I think we... Oh, no, 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 no. Need to come one more across. You're going to come right up there and go in, 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 in. And you can just come straight in from this side. Will it matter, really, how I do this? I don't think so. I'm missing an entire step out here. I have just realised, by the way. Uh, you're going to come out, 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 and out. And go up there. That will work. I just need to get... No! Cut that off. I need my uh, thingamajigs. What are they? It is the melter, right? That takes scrap into... Sl no, I need the crusher. The pulverizer, even. One, two, three, four, five. There, yeah, that should be enough. And a router's all the way down there. And then this comes down like that. Goes across and in. Oh, it's like playing Factorio again. These are going to need their own power supply as well. Just do that. Oh yeah, we're out of silicon. So that's not going to work. You know what? It's going to have to be a small one. Oh, actually a small one works quite nicely. Just go like that. They're not all getting scraps. <clears throat> I'm sure I did this before and we got ridiculous amounts. They're not even getting towards where I need to see. I know I'm never up there to see, but they're not getting anywhere near. Um, I'm going to have to pull uh, this down for now. That'll be fine. Oh, I need junctions and all sorts, uh, routers and all sorts down here. 
So that's silicon coming in. I just need to get it all the way back up here now. I'm sure I made this work better last time. Now none of them are working. Was there something wrong on the belt there? You know what I think it is. I hate to do this because I've just built it. I know exactly what it is. I need a gap. So they've got room to actually spread out. Like that. And then you can come down and in. And then you can come down and in. Unfortunately, that can now not come in a perfectly straight line. But not the biggest of problems. Just go like that, and that should join it all up. That's better. Yeah, it's working a little bit better now. All right, let's get this silicon coming back in. And can I go straight up there? Yeah, I can. Now I want to go across and up. Like that. Straight up past the copper. Oh no, they took a single wall out. Whatever will I do? Alright, I think we're going to have to come through this middle way now. Let's keep this one as low as possible. I can actually jump that wall there, can I not? Yeah, yeah, I can. And where are you going to come? I mean, really, I could go to the copper and down like that. All the way down there and in there. Have I missed a bit? Or are we good? Right, what's wrong with you guys now? You're missing sand. Well, that's just silly. Why do these not work properly? And then you need to come straight up. Oh, that's why. It only needs to be like that. No, no, that's not right at all. Oh, God. Hey. <sighs> Put all that back. I screwed my design up. Um, the router's not junctions. What an idiot. Junction, junction, junction. That is how it needs to be. Still got a little bit of sand left. I know this sand in there. I know I could just get the other thing on here, but no. Let's come across there. Up there and in. Are we good now? I believe we are now good. How are we doing for power as well? Plus 600. It's not massive, but how are you doing for heat? 840. That is ridiculous. And I honestly don't think we need two of these, but I just like the idea of having two of these. How did we do this then? Goes there and there. You then come in there. You know what? I don't need that there, do I? Because it does supply them automatically. Let's 
If I put that in, that then supplies them with water. That's why I don't need two. Because it's going to be two either end anyway. I need to make sure that's right before I let it go. I really hope that can keep up. Otherwise, this will be devastating. There's actually none on that side already. Fair dues. Fair dues. I've got silicon coming in now, at least. Oh, there's enemies. Let's go and have a look. Right, so they're destroying that wall, which isn't really a problem. That one doesn't need to be there now. No, they're literally trying to get through this because it's the easiest point. Not all that concerned. Oh, maybe I should be a little bit concerned. Hey! Cheeky. Yeah, I need to work on my defences a bit. We're at 30 minutes already. What? You can get lost. Nope, flying a straight line. Hmm. I don't like that. That's not really going to work how I want. Hello. Didn't see you up there. Oh, that one can go there. Get rid of that one. These will get healed by the menders eventually. <clears throat> I'd have to brick this in so much more. But sure, they're still going to see that as the quickest way through. No matter how thick I build this, right? You'd have thought, anyway. I need to go and get more thorium going. Uh, get rid of this rubbish out of the way. Get rid of this, get rid of this, get rid of this. <clears throat> Let's get these going. Now, I would like to get these all boosted up with water. <clears throat> I knew how I was going to make it work last time. Just get two of them there, although two of them's a little bit overkill. So if I come down this way and in, I can have water there and water on the outside. <clears throat> Up there, water can come on the outside, and we can have water on... Well, actually... That needs to get built. I really hope that doesn't screw things up. Just give me a couple of... I need to get these like out of the way somewhere. Get rid of this wall. <clears throat> and then... You can both come down here. And go into a water tank. It is water you guys need, right? It just says liquid. Although cryo fluid would work better, wouldn't it? Nope, just water. <clears throat> so. Give me a liquid router right there. There, there, and there. There, there, and there. Then you can come up this way, up this way, and there. Thorium for days, right? Up there and there. Highly doubt I'll have enough water to make this all work, but it's getting there. They produce an absolute shed load of thorium. What the hell? <clears throat> I might even need two lines coming in at this rate. That is ridiculous. Yeah, I need to get working on my defense. Oh, it looks like they're trying to come through this way now. That'd be cool. You're full on power. You're full on power. I mean, more thorium reactors is definitely the way to go, especially with all this. They're filling up nicely. That's filling up nicely. You know what I want to get straight away? I never unlocked the large launch pad, unfortunately. 
if I just put you right there. Now I need to put you one further away, don't I? Yeah, just fill that launch pad up. Why not? Right, defense is coming. Oh, no, 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 no. Needs to be one more tile. Go there. Go there. Now, technically, this will run out over time. But that fills up. No, no, it's not going to run out over time. Yeah, that's brilliant. Give me all the thoriums. I could even get another one. Bit greedy. I need to get shipping thorium in case I like ruin this level then. <clears throat> um, can we get more water coming from this way? You know what? Yeah, we can. Because I can do that and that. Eh, yeah, this isn't going to work as well this side, but anywho. Um, let's have a bridge conduit go... There to there, and there to there. You can come up this way, and then that should actually get water. Yeah, this isn't going to be enough. That gives them slightly more water. Wow, still not enough. Right, now it's filling up. You're getting water. Love it. You can come up this way and go that way. You can go into a liquid junction there and there. That sorts them ones. And we're just going to wrap this around the back and in like that. I don't possibly think we could get any more thorium from this now. They are all connected, right? That one's a little bit redundant. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's good. Build the defences. Oh, now we're on 37 minutes. I need to finish this episode off, don't I? Hmm. And we definitely need a huge power bank as building up as well. So, in fact, how am I going to get power in here? I need to wrap it up and round. I'm basically planning that they never get through this defence. Which is probably a little bit optimistic, but... We've got the reactor working without exploding. Please don't all go into the corner. I think they're all going to get to this tile and stop. Yeah. They are. So before I build this up more, I think we want to redesign. I think we want these walls too thick. Which I can actually do straight away. I've just got to take the menders out and shuffle this back. I can take you out as well. Because then that's going to come across this way. I don't like that they don't line up. Go like that. It doesn't leave me much room in there for defence, but... It seems like a too thick wall is enough to deter them. But I can get another defensive wall across this bit. Along the bottom and have them come through this way. So if they get through that bit then we kind of are screwed. Would I be able to get like two rows of turrets in there? I should be able to. That can go there, that can go there. It's all going to be about the menders and stuff as well. How am I doing for titanium? I've nearly got all the titanium back. Last thing, and then we are going to end this episode. You're not running out of cryofluid. Nope. Good. Um, I would like an overflow gate right there. Oh, no. Let's get sending some titanium back as well. Any spare titanium. Because at the minute, all spare thorium is going back. I kind of understand what the vaults are for now. Actually, 
damn it. Do that there instead. <clears throat> and then I can get unpacker and unpacker. Why are you not building the vault at all? What do I need for a vault? I need thorium. Oh, I've not got any thorium going to base at all. Well, that's fun. <clears throat> like I say, that's where we're going to have to leave this episode off. One more minute. One minute. Yeah. Next episode, we are definitely working on defences because these dudes... Annoying... I don't even know if they've destroyed anything. I don't think they've destroyed anything. Are you guys not meant to, like, shoot at this? You've got no ammo. Okay. So what's there, then? Containers. Pneumatic drill. Eh, I don't know. It looks like it's set up and like it should actually do something, but it doesn't. We are full on copper. I need to get sending copper back as well. Hey, as long as I can send 10,000 titanium and 5,000 of all the other ones back, I'll be a happy man. Damn it! And we need to get all the thorium going back as well. We've got two more enemies. Oh. Hey, that's cheating. Goddamn stupid. You. Come on, get lost. What has he destroyed out of the middle of there? Was that batteries? <clears throat> oh yeah, I did just screw this up. I meant to make the front wall there too thick. We'll sort it out next time. Yeah, what were they? Unloaders. Oh, I don't even need unloaders in the middle, so what? Oh, I don't know. Anyway... That is going to be it for today's episode, so thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated, as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers! <laughs>